All of us have our life, and then we have our work life. Interestingly, in separating our work from our life, we often develop a different persona at work. This is because we feel that in order to be professional, we cannot be the way that we are with our friends and family. It is true that we can't giggle hysterically or tell crude jokes at work because we want people to take us seriously. Yet the thing is, we don't have to be serious and stern to be professional or to be respected. The irony is that in our quest to be professional, we do not show the best part of ourselves. Whilst we are warm, friendly and engaging in real life, we are more professional and robotic in our work life. This is why when you check in at a hotel, you'll be greeted by a smile that never reaches the eyes or be given monotonous directions very politely. But when we're with our family and friends, our smile lights up our eyes and our tone expressive and warm. Which means that we are capable of displaying the warmest and most sincere characteristics, but somehow our mind separates the way we are in life to how we should be at work. Sometimes we even reserve the best part of us only for the people we know and like. And yes, whilst we don't have to go around kissing and hugging everyone, our warmth and sincerity should be present all the time and to everyone. Genuine warmth is often the missing link between an okay interaction and a great interaction, especially in customer service, but also in our day-to-day -day interaction with every single person we come across. Don't give and hold back warmth like a switch you turn on and off. Be that same amazing person that people love you for, at work or everywhere you go, and you'll see that the great human connection it creates pay off for your career. So be professional, but don't forget to be sincere and to be happy, always.